Welcome to the JA Fellows Company Program Series. I'm your host, Martha Rios. And today I have an amazing guest with us. She is the, <laughs> let's restart. Sorry, let's come down because we, we can't stop it. <laughs> Sorry. Do you want your, is it your kids? Do you want them with you maybe? You can. No, it's okay. Mariah, y'all okay? can't come downstairs right now. <laughs> All right. That's okay. We'll do five minutes or so. That's totally fine. <laughs> I'm ready. All righty. No problem. So let's get this again. Four, three, two, one. Hi, everybody. Welcome to the JA Fellows Company Program Series. I'm your host, Martha Rios. And today I have an amazing guest with us. She is the JA Fellows Lead Teacher of Dillard High School. She's done it for two years and she exemplifies the going from good to great. She has done an amazing job with the kids. And for that reason, she is the JA Fellows uh, Lead Teacher of the Year 2020. Please help me welcome Miss Kenesha Raven. <laughs> Hi, Kenesha. How are you today? I'm good. Awesome. So please tell us a little bit about yourself and your relationship with the JA Fellows Company Program. Well, hello, everyone. I'm Ms. Reynolds. I'm um, a teacher at Dillard High School 6 through 12. I'm a part of the Magnet Program teachers. Um, I teach entrepreneurship there and my business ownership students are a part of the JA Fellows Program. And this is our second year participating. Awesome. It has been such an amazing experience to see you and your students uh, implement these two amazing companies. And do you want to do you want to tell us a little bit about SafeBlock and, and how the product was created and how you collaborated uh, with other mentors in the classroom and how your students rose from you know regular high schoolers to young entrepreneurs? Share with us a little bit. Yes, um, Safe Block last year was an amazing product created by the students because if you're not familiar with it in school, when we have cold red, when the school has to be locked down, we have to cover our windows. So teachers sometimes have to use fine paper and tape to cover their windows. So the students came up with a br brilliant idea with a magnet that was easy access to help cover the windows. Um, a little challenges because what happened is they they created this product on their own so it wasn't out on the market so they manufactured the product on their own um and this is just has taught the kids more leadership skills collaboration skills and teamwork absolutely and, and we couldn't be prouder of those students and, and in addition to that this year you also implemented the program and one of your students miss Shatasia daniels has been awarded another um scholarship through our partnership with comerica bank would you like to share with us what does it feel to see those students you know go from from high schoolers and now they're ready to go to to colleges and universities what what's your take on that because they, their success is yours too kanisha yes it's always amazing to see your students getting ready to transfer form from high school students to college students um ashley shatasia i have watched her sit in the classroom um during study hall to apply for many scholarships um, she's very self-driven and she's going to do well. She's going to attend Florida State University. And I'm just so excited for everyone, all of my seniors. Um, a lot of them do want to be entrepreneurs, which means a lot to me because I love entrepreneurship. Because with 21st century, as you can see, as things, things are closing, we will need more entrepreneurs um, in the world. Absolutely. I totally agree with you. And I and I and it warmed my heart to hear her say that she is also an entrepreneur herself, yes. even though yes, she's going to <laughs> yes, even though she's going to, to to Florida University. So so that is awesome. Any any words um, of, of of advice for new JA fellows teachers that might be considering implementing this 
um, outstanding hands-on program. I know it's a lot of work, so put it out there. What would you say to new teachers considering the program? Um, I would say don't get frustrated with the students because for a lot of them, it's something new. So it takes time to mold them into what you want to see. But once they see that there are rewards at the end, um, everything will start to come together. So I would say be patient with the students and just keep pushing them and encouraging them to do their best. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you so much, uh, Kanisha. It's, it's been a pleasure this first two years. I hope it's the first of many, many more years where we keep our partnership. Uh, we at Junior Achievement absolutely love to work with uh, Dillard High School, with you, with uh, Magnet Coordinator Jessica Swamson, uh, with the principal. I, I think we have a lot more to, to do so that we keep uh, empowering uh, young uh, students in our community. So, uh, once again, congratulations. We absolutely uh, love collaborating with you and JA Fellows Teacher of the Year 2020. Uh, thank you again. Any last uh, words for, for our kids and for our audience? I would just say even in hard times that we are now, just keep pushing um, and try to find innovative ways to continue to um progress because we all did not know that this was going to happen, but we find creative ways to keep going. And that's basically it. Yes, absolutely. I agree with you. We all had to pivot and, and, and basically keep on going. And that's how we created our JA Fellows Virtual Award. And that's why now we have the opportunity to um, create this, this program in order to share and highlight the benefits of implementing the J Fellows Company program, a program that allows high schoolers to create a real small business from the conception of a product all the way to the liquidation of the company, but obviously with the support and guidance of lead teachers like you, Kanisha, and uh, mentors from our community. So that's it for today. Thank you so much. And we will see, of course, thank you. And we will see everybody else at our next edition. Have a wonderful day. All right. That was awesome, Kenicha. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I really appreciate it. And I will see you Wednesday, right? You're stopping by? Yes, Wednesday. Yes. Awesome. Awesome. So thank I'll see you. you Wednesday and we'll be in touch. Take care. Bye. Bye.